How's everyone going? Welcome back to another coverage 998 Valley Vlogs video. It's time to do a, hopefully do another day vlog, assuming that I don't change my mind halfway through it and turn it into a um, normal um, behind the scenes vlog. But yeah, so we're starting our day at uh, Ormond. The fact that I said Ormond, probably you can guess what, and by the title, probably kind of self explanatory what this video is. Time to chase the, it's time to follow the second Moorabbin Bayside shuttles. Hope everyone's been well. It's been a while since doing a proper vlog video. It's well, it's obviously been a while. I haven't been, uh, we've been in lockdown, so uh, good to finally be at, back out again. Uh, was out yesterday for the Tate run, so obviously, this video is going to be out quite later than the actual video. It's still coming out a bit earlier than usual. So, yeah, um, the train has eight, uh, A29 at six and K190. Uh, train will be operating in the center rail, so we're just going to wait here for well for them to show up uh, uh, haven't done almond in a while haven't done almond since if i recall since the uh, uh, since the uh when they had the open day for the three stations so yeah um you can hear the cockatoos all around the area so uh it's uh I can't remember how many how low the temperature is but i think it's about eight about um 10 degrees ish so it's very cold but uh yeah, especially seeing we're going Bayside as well. Uh, today's video will be slightly different because you will notice that the ca uh, that the shots may change a little bit, uh, or uh, or suddenly the stability may die randomly because we are going to be using two, hopefully using two different cameras for this um, video, just for mainly easier fire management and so that my battery doesn't die. Anyhow, hope you guys enjoy. Time to wait for the steam train to turn up. Right, well that's that. Train just went through. Just went. Uh, well, I should have just hit through Bentley actually, not Bentley, McKinnon. It's time to jump on the next train. Eleven minutes ago, and uh, time to get with it.
Alrighty, haven't been able to talk for a little while, but anyhow, we ran out. Hi, this is for our, oh, I don't even know, this is for the upshot, uh, upshot, well, the first shuttle, so it's actually the first up for the day from, um, from Canada. So yeah, it's starting to drizzle a little bit, uh, haven't been to, actually haven't been to Hyatt before, so let's see how that goes, um, yeah, so train's due here in about 20 minutes, um, I think there may have been a voiceover section before this, if not then I may have sliced a little shot now of a, um, the few issues that we have with um, rail fanning, uh, and the few issues that uh, we get blamed for despite the fact that it's uh, not entire, sometimes not entirely our fault. Yeah, uh, our intentions for the day is that we will basically be out for the whole day um, and finishing off with the transfer train, uh, so it's going to be a, a long Here we go. So um, that was a little unexpected. We made a slight side stop at Astondale before going out to Morab uh, to Mordialo to see the Long Island. So that was nice to see a BL on the front of the Long Island again. It's been a very long while since that's happened. So anyhow, um, we're just going to continue onwards to basically two stations, one station down to Mordialo, and then travel down. We should have enough time to get down to the creek before the train. Comes. So time to get moving again. All right, so now back on the on the on the foot. Time to head to the creek.
so we're basically past our, um, well, we've finished off lunch. It's now, I don't know, what's the time? Ah, good question. <laughs> Whatever that is. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, uh, just waiting for the last shuttle down service before it heads back up, uh, heads back on, on the up and basically heads back to uh, Melbourne. So, the end of, a ne uh, end of, end of the day is nearly, uh, nearly here. So we're back at Melbourne Benton Station after going to the shot at the crossing. I was meant to make the last train, didn't make it because I'm not fast enough. It was a bit slippery as well, so I had to take caution to get there anyways. So initial plans was to go to Seaholm, that's obviously not not Seaholm, uh Seaford, sorry. Uh, obviously that's not happening because Seaford is uh basically the same time they depart from um uh Kamnook, so a bit too close for my liking, so make it jump onto the train, just go further down the line somewhere, and then we'll probably call it a day after that. So, to be one or two spots left, we'll see how we go. Sunset over there. I kind of wish that the rain didn't just fall onto my um hand. That's uh, that's not so testy. Um, how rigid this phone is. <laughs> but uh, so yeah, we're gonna attempt for one more. Oh, sorry, not for the shot there. Yeah, that was our final spot for the night. Uh, just waiting for the traffic light to go. Then we can finally head over. Whenever it goes, it'll be great. I don't know if it's automatic no traffic light, but anyhow. Well, with that, I thank you guys for joining me for this video. It's been a kind of pretty fun day. <laughs> Tiring day indeed, but um, yeah. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully catch you all in the next vlog.